Hey guys, uh, I'm going to show you how you can configure your controller to play Final Fantasy VIII. Uh, on my side, I don't have the uh, remaster version, so I'm unaware if the uh, exact same problem exists uh, on the other version, but uh, anyway, um, if it doesn't work, eh, the, this solution uh, will probably help you. So on my side, if I go into settings, uh, the game doesn't even recognize the controller I have plugged in. So uh, I can't even click on the controller menu, even though I have the uh, PS5 uh, controller plugged in. So what you need to know is uh, your key uh, keyboard settings. So uh, if you have the default key um, this is what I have here so uh, if you're using the exact same then uh, you'll be able to uh, um, to bind the, the exact same key uh, as what I will do so basically I'll just uh, bind uh, keyboard keys uh, on my controller and uh, this will emulate the keyboard and uh, yeah it's it's gonna work so let's exit that and so to set this up you need to right click on the steam icon and go into big picture mode so from there you'll find your Final Fantasy 8 game so click on it and then manage game and controller configuration so this is what I uh, this is what I have set up right now, and uh, but uh, you might have some other configuration. So I'm gonna redo that um, uh, from what what I had previously. So what you want to do is uh, browse config, and you can probably try uh, some other. Uh, configuration from the community. Uh, I haven't tried them, but uh, probably some of them might work, but uh, if you're unsure, like uh, <laughs> uh, I'm unsure on my side, so let's go with template. So this is the template uh, I saved, but uh, let's go with a basic template. So with a keyboard and mouse, so now uh, I'm in preview mode, so let's apply this configuration. And from, uh, from there, I'll be able to change uh, each key bind. So let's start with, uh, with this. So all I have to do is uh, I can click here or I can uh, also press uh, the key on my keyboard. And uh, if I put uh, something in there, uh, that's just a label. So let's say uh, this is the up key and I click on the up key there. And then let's do uh, all the other keys. So left. And right. and down all right so so this is all uh, all change now um, if you prefer to uh, play with the uh, with the joystick, then uh, you can apply the, the exact same setting here. Mm -hmm. So let's do that. Mm -hmm. Let's do the same. Down. Mm -hmm. All right, and um, 
there's something else. Oh yeah, uh, click action. So because you can actually click on your uh, on your joystick, mm -hmm. let's remove that. And now we have exactly uh, the same uh, for the arrows there and the uh, joystick. Now, uh, on my side, I'm not using this joystick, so let's just remove that. So it won't do anything. And now the buttons. So, um... <laughs> Obviously, uh, I have a PS5 controller, so this is the uh, triangle key. But uh, on the keyboard, it's going to be the V key to go into menu. And now the square key. And again, uh, you don't have to, uh, to put text in there, it's just uh, fancy. Uh, the important thing is that uh, you click on the right key. So here it's going to be the S key. Now this is circle. And the X key. Now, some of you, uh, if you've played on the uh, original game, I think uh, this is uh, the action and cancel. But uh, I'm kind of used to have uh, this uh, inverse. So this is my... Uh, um, this is the cancel key and this is the action button. So uh, put it... Uh, how you like, and uh, it's going to be uh, just fine. All right, so um, here I have... Um, so this is the L2, and I'm going to assign the D key. Now, L1, I'm going to assign H. Here this is right 2, I'm going to assign F. And here, R1, I'm going to assign uh, G. Now the start button. So this is start button and I'm gonna assign the A key. And here the select button. It's gonna be the J key. And is there anything left? Um, I think that's it. Maybe we could remove that. So it doesn't uh, do anything funny. And um, I think uh, we're all set up. So obviously if you want, uh, you can probably save this config uh, with export, I think. Uh, I did that a long time ago, so uh, you'll have to uh, figure that uh, for yourself, but uh, this is how you can uh, configure this. And now let's, let's go back and exit, uh, exit big picture. Now let's try the game and let's see if this works. Now um, my um, the sound might be a little bit loud, but uh, let me try to uh, have the sound uh, 
uh, at least a bit low so you can understand me. So yeah, uh, my action button enters the menu and uh, my circle button uh, is actually cancelling so this is working good. Now can I go into menu? Yeah. And the rotation works. So yeah, everything works fine. And uh, that's it. So hope this helps. See ya. Bye.